Hey, what's going on everybody? It's John Levy and uh, it's not day two, but I'm calling this my second walk because I'm not doing my days consecutively. Again, my walk is for the American Cancer Society. Again, I was uh, diagnosed in uh, February with colon cancer and so far I've been a cancer survivor. Me and my uh, little girl Maisie, Maze, oh, she likes to sniff trees. She don't even go to the bathroom, she just sniffs trees. That's all she does. Right, so. Maze, you done? Anyway. But, uh, talked about my why already. And, uh, again, this, this will be another, uh, three mile walk. So, in two walks, I would have walked six miles out of 40 for the uh, month of March, which is cool. Getting the job done. Anyway, uh, I'm going to use this uh, video also as a uh, event in session. We had a situation that occurred last night, and uh, this is this this is going to be about parents because kids are going to be kids, and uh, there's really not much you can do. But as a parent, you have to parent. So, situation happened, and. Uh, parent wasn't home and uh, I had the grandmother of the parent I gave her my number and had the parent call me so with that the guy calls me and I said look I'd rather talk face to face than rather over the phone and, you know I did that walked around the cordial gentleman that I am I went up there and introduced myself shook the guy's hand and to make a long story short it was a not my kid moment as a parent i'm not saying i'm the best parent but come on Mace. good morning but as a responsible parent i did my due diligence and again when i was met by the not my kid syndrome um i basically said to the guy we're going to leave the conversation at this and i walked away the problem with this nowadays everyone is if you keep having this not my kid syndrome this is where society is going wrong i wasn't asking for the guy to beat his kid i wasn't asking for the guy to throw him in a cage and, and you know throw the key away what i'm asking for is uh some cooperation and as two parents come to a conclusion and figure things out. But it didn't happen that way. And this was last night. And I'm still kind of like fuming about it, like my adrenaline's going. So my wife tells me to forget about it. And I'm trying to. So using this walk to uh, for two different purposes. I need to clear my mind. And uh, pray for these parents that have the not my kid syndrome because again it's not doing anybody any justice so i'm not going to bore y'all guys any much longer with this besides Maisie's running around like an ape and uh oh, mace mace Maisie, mace want to say hello to everybody huh want to say hello to everybody to everybody you're taking a walk today so we'll catch y'all guys up and we'll uh, see you during another portion of the walk see ya all right, everybody, as you can see, we made it to uh, the Rowan Street Bridge of Penny Pack Park here. There's a parking lot. I did my 1.49 miles. And I figured while I was here, I'd talk a little bit about Penny Pack Park. Upcoming in about a few weeks is going to be the uh, opening day of trout season. And in Penny Pack Park here in Philadelphia, at the Ron Street, you have his bridge here, and all along here, all the way down. I don't want to go in the sand. This, uh, this will all be loaded with the trout fishermen. You can see we got some ducks out there. Good part about Mother Nature. I figured I'd uh, bring this way. Last year, I was here up, I was up on that bridge and uh, 
I was filming a lot of the guys out here fishing. The tough part about it is a lot of the guys had their lines in the water before 8 o'clock. And uh, when I was filming, I, I saw a game warden guy. He asked me where my rod was. Right, Mace? He asked me where I, my rod was, and I told him I wasn't fishing. I was just filming. So, come on, Mace. Let's make our way back. Gotta lead the way. So, I'll give you a chance to sniff for a little bit. But anyway, what the hell is that? A little cat farm or something like that? Hey, just come over here. Check his out. Come here. Let's see what we got going on here. I knew there was a bunch of, uh... Yep. There's a lot of, uh, stray cats. Oh, you can see one climbing up the hill here. Anyway, somebody must have built them a, uh... Must have built them a little house for the, uh... The winter time. So that way, I guess they can keep warm and whatnot. Maisie! Stop pulling! Hey, you keep pulling, we're not gonna take you on trips no more. Maze, you keep pulling, we're not gonna do this. All right, come on, let's go for, let's head back. And y'all, you can see uh, some of the uh, urban art, as we call it, on here. When we get a little further up, I'll show you some of the urban art. But this here, you get a lot of people. A lot of people like to fish under this bridge. On here, as you can see the urban art there. All along here. All some pretty decent fishing spots for trout season. Come on, Mace. Come on, Mace. You don't know whether you want to come or go. So, all right, everybody. So, heading back through the tunnel up towards the uh, the other way, so uh, we'll see in a little bit. Here is uh, some of that urban art I was telling you about. It's actually not bad looking. I mean, these guys could do something a little bit different. I mean, look at the colors. Colors are nice. Although it's not a lot of that just scribble junk that's on there really not that bad I gotta share that but eh, really not that bad oh well, here we are at the end of our uh, end of our walk the uh, most dreaded part of my uh, three mile walk Oh man, I, I, we got to come up with a name for this hill. If anybody can come up with a name, I mean, it's not like it's a mountain or anything, but if anybody can come up with a name for this hill to get back home, do me a favor, throw it in the uh, comments section below. And uh, again, my page is uh, YouTube is Johnny Belize. Hit that like button, subscribe. We're doing this for a great cause for the American Cancer Society in the uh, month of uh, March. Good morning. Good morning. On the uh, colon cancer awareness. So do me a favor, hit that like and subscribe button. And here we are. <laughs> I almost want to call it Mount Fiji. Holy Christ. You guys seen it last time. But here we are. See it behind me. There it is. So, you ready, Mace? Let's do this. Hold on, hold on, hold on. All right, let's do this. All right, let's go. Come on. Got it, girl. Lead the way, Maisie. Lead the way. Don't stop. Keep walking. All right. The dreaded walk. Come on. You're slowing down already. Got it, girl. Puppy power. Here you go. Mush. So, anyway, like I said, and you guys got a name for this mountain hill. Throw it in the fire. Where you go? At it, girl. Let's go this way up, up the hill. 
well thank you guys for uh, coming in with us again me and Maisie we had a good time walking a little bit of chatting but again like I said before this is uh, this walks for a good cause for the American Cancer Society for uh, Colon Cancer Awareness Month which is this whole month of March so that's uh, six miles in, in uh, two days again I won't be doing this consecutively right Mace we won't be doing it all the time unless you see the puppy up there so uh, we're gonna do it periodically but uh for, for twice six miles looks like we're gonna have us accomplished so thank you all guys for joining in with me with this nice walk on a beautiful day thank you for listening to me event for a little bit but uh we're all in this together fighting a good cause thanks for joining in